Hi, uh, this is gonna be the very short overview of our platform, the way it works, the way you can just create a simple invoice and send it to your customer. As you can see, we have a couple of tabs on the left side. Um, let me just go one by one. So in that case, it would be your payments. If you have the e-commerce store and you just wanna track all of your orders, that's the place you can do it. You can sort it by the status so you can decide if you wanna see the canceled, if the paid one, or even the one with the all status. So in that case, you can search it one by one. Um, that's literally the same when it comes to the invoicing. The invoicing is available for you. You can use exactly the same uh, tabs, which is the status and the time frame. On the left side, uh, you have the settlements. The settlements are the place where you can just track all of your uh, information for your accountant. So in that case, this is what we're doing for you. You don't have to stress about it. You can download everything in a PDF or even the spreadsheet for your accountant. So you can share it uh, with them after that. Integrations are for the people who want to put us on a website. So this is a very simple solution where you just decided in which platform you're going to use us, uh, on which platform, and then you can just press it, generate the new credentials, and put it on a website. Uh, so as I promised, let me just create a new invoice. I'm going to use a completely different account for that case. So I go to the payment, I press invoices. As you can see, I've already made one, but let me just do one more. I press the new invoice. I'm going to keep it my details because it's already saved. I usually take it, send the invoice to the customer via email. Um, let me put the country in Poland. As you can see, uh, we have a lot of fiat currencies which we can do the conversion for, but for the purpose of this video, let me make it in euro. So five euros and let's just put it as a presentation. Lugano 2. Okay, I press generate the invoice after filling up the form. Now, if some of you uh, don't want to send the email, you can share the link with your customer, which is this one. Or if you go straight away to the email address, you'll be able to see there is an invoice to pay. Uh, it's the second one in that case because I've used it before, but in that case, there's a basic information presentation to Lugano. And me as a customer, I can see this. So I press pay the invoice and it's moving me to the Utrust page. As you can see, we are accepting some cryptocurrencies. In that case is Bitcoin, Ethereum, eGold, UTK, USDC, USDT, USDT on a Polygon and a Dash. Uh, for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna use uh, the USDT on Polygon. So in that case, as your customer got 15 minutes to make a payment, I can decide it. I'm just making a payment in this cryptocurrency. Now, from that moment onwards, the time is on, I can literally make a payment uh, from any wallet I want. If it's a cold wallet, hot wallet, obviously on every single transaction, we have to do the KYT, which is no transaction. We verify that for you. You don't have to stress about it. In that case, let me do it manually. So I copy the information. I'm going to the MetaMask. Now, I'll make a payment, so I press send, put in the address. Instead of the Matic, I put USDT and I want to make a payment of $4. Let me just make it five. Even I press send, confirm it with the current fee, and the payment is done. And in a second, you'll be able to see the confirmation here. Here we go. Me as a customer, I can see the payment was complete, and obviously you'll receive the email shortly. Now, me as a customer, I can see the payment is on the way to Adrian, which I obviously invoiced myself. In that case, this is just a confirmation and a saying thank you from the Utrust family that you used us. So uh, once we confirm the payment, you'll be notified uh, ASAP. So for the purpose of this video, I've created completely two different invoicing. Um, so the one which was already paid is the first one you'll be able to say it's paid in that case, because obviously we need enough confirmation on the blockchain. Uh, this can take some time, but in that case, you can just click on that one and see it's pending. As soon as it's done, it will change the status for the paid. And here we go. You receive the money in your bank account.